Hello, my name is Candace Woodruff, and I am Executive Vice President Gold here in my econ. I am super excited to be sharing with you the information that is changing people's lives all across the country. Now, when I say changing people's lives, I'm not saying that just because it sounds good. I'm saying it because it's true. You see, we have real people and real results. I can even speak for myself that even having a master's degree and a corporate position, I still did not understand the value of my money until I started using the strategies and education of my econ. So I can say that it's truly changed my life. So let's get started so that you can see what everyone is so excited about. And I know you're wondering, well, why is it that we're really worried about our finances? Well, the sad truth is, out of 320 million Americans, 95% of them are financially stressed. Yes, that's a big number. So this is how we see it in my econ. Right now, there is a financial cancer going on in America, and we believe that we have the cure to that cancer. So who are we? Well, my econ is a fast-growing, debt-free, and technology-driven company. We do everything online, and our owners are really smart men. They open the company with their own money, so we don't owe anyone anything. We've been around for about 10 years, and we're based out of Atlanta, Georgia. Our leaders, well, they've been in the, the industry collectively for about 100 years, and let's just say they have documented success, which is great. Our mission statement is to empower people to attain personal financial success. You see, I stress the word personal in that because I'm sure you would agree with me in saying that you have to help yourself before you can help anyone else. So let's keep going. While we're helping ourselves, we understand that all of us wake up every single day with two objectives. The first one is to maintain our current lifestyle. We want to take care of our kids. We want to pay our bills, those types of things. The second objective is for us, for us to make enough money right now, but also to make enough money to last us into retirement. You see, the government tells us that we need 12 times the amount we make right now to last us into retirement. So what does that really look like? Well, if you make $50,000 right now, you need over $500,000 to last you into retirement, and that's a lot of money. So we're sharing some great information with you, but we have to understand where our money is really going. Now, with those two objectives, we have four challenges. The first challenge, well, it's inflation. What is inflation, Candace? Inflation is the constant rise of everything around you going up, but your income, well, it stays the same because gas is constantly going up, groceries are going up, daycare is going up, but does your job give you a raise whenever the grocery go up? Absolutely not. So that's inflation. The buying power of your dollar goes down every single day. The second challenge is taxes. We're going to go a little deeper into this later, but taxes take about a third of your income off the top. Did you know that the average American between the age of 18 and 60, that they make about a million dollars in their lifetime? Wow. Where does that million dollars go? Well, the first third goes to taxes. You never see it. The second third goes to debt, and then we're forced to live and retire off the last third of our money. See, this is a challenge, and many of us don't have a strategy or a plan to even know where the last third goes. So that's taxes, and we're going to go deeper into that. But the third challenge is debt. Wow. You see, I can speak for myself when it comes to debt because I had plenty of it. Let's talk about it just a second. I have, you know, the, the great degrees, but I did not have a trust fund or, or many scholarships, so I had to get student loans. Yes. Student loans are a financial epidemic going on in America right now. On top of the student loans, I got credit cards. I got a car loan because I couldn't walk to class. And then, well, let's just say I was really excited when I graduated, and I got myself a nice home, which is a 30-year mortgage. Yes, a whole lot of debt. So with all those things combined, before the age of 30 years old, I was in over $200,000 worth of debt. See, this is very common in America, very common. I looked good, but I did not feel so good because I had debt up to my ears. So what's really happening now is that my econ has given me a strategy so that I'll have all of my debt paid off in six and a half years. Yes, I said it, six and a half years using a strategy. And we're going to share that strategy with you in just a second. Now let's go to this fourth challenge. The reason for the first three is because of a lack of financial education. You see, we don't know what to do with our money. Many times we're trained to make money, 
spend money and then save a little bit, and if something happens, then that money's gone, right? So let's talk about the solutions that we provide with these challenges that we face every single day. The first solution is we show you how to lower your taxes. Well, how do we do that? Many people work a job, and they fill out this form called the W-4. The W-4 form is often filled out incorrectly by 80% of Americans. That's a big number. So what we do is we make sure that that form is filled out correctly, and when it's filled out the correct way, many people get usually about, about two to $800 back into their home. See, this is called cash flow. Once you get that cash flow, we say, hey, use the extra money that you were never seeing before and start to get rid of that debt that's hanging over your head. That's major. So now we're using the extra money, getting rid of our debt, and we want to speed up our process a little bit because we're having a great experience, so we want to share this knowledge and education with other people. Well, let's just say that the company sends you a small check for doing so, and we teach you how to get you some business income to make your process faster. While doing this, these things, we teach the power of investment education. This is major because money making money is way more powerful than us or labor making money. We have to understand that. So these are our solutions. I know you have a pen and pad, so make sure you take these down, and let me share with you how this really works. The key is to shift your mindset. And we're going to actually shift your mindset as we go through this, but we're really wanting you to understand what the difference between assets and liabilities are. You see, we know that assets make you money and liabilities take money out of your pocket. We also, um, also tell you, hey, go pick up a book. Let's read some books. Let's read together so that we can expand our knowledge and expand our minds. See, education is the key, and we have to apply this education to our lives. We're teaching you the difference between a cash flow asset and an equity asset. You see, we know that a cash flow asset makes you money right now, and an equity asset makes you money later. We're teaching you how to turn your home, regardless if you're renting or you're buying, into a cash flow asset right now. And I know you want to know how to do that, and I'm going to share that with you in just a second. We understand that there's two tax systems in America, one for the business owner and one for the employee. We also get that we choose to get paid three different ways. Now, as an employee, we're taxed at the highest rate of 28 to 33%. As a business owner, we are taxed at 18 to 23%, and that's the net effect. Now, as an investor, we're taxed around give or take 10%, and that's, you know, up and down depending on what you're investing in. So let me ask you a question really quickly. What is taken out of your paycheck before you get it? Hmm. Well, many things, right? But taxes are a major part of that. So let's look at this concept. You pay the highest amount in taxes, and the government gets your money before you do. Now, after you pay your taxes, then you pay your bills, and then, well, you pay yourself. See, this is a challenge because many Americans don't have enough cash flow to pay themselves at the end of their, of the end of their money. So what we teach you is very powerful. We're teaching you the power of business ownership. The power of business ownership says, hey, pay yourself first, then pay your bills, then pay taxes. Look a lot better? Absolutely. So I know you're wondering, well, Candace, what is the business? I don't have a business. I don't understand. Well, you're in luck because my econ is a home-based business, and we teach the power of business ownership, and we teach financial principles and education so that you can help yourself, and then you can care enough to share that knowledge to help other people. See, we're a strategy type company. This is awesome. So let's keep going so I can really share with you how this works. We all know that McDonald's is on every corner. We consider them as being big business. Well, did you know that McDonald's and home based businesses like my econ have the same tax benefits? Oh, yeah. So let's look at the expenses that McDonald's has. Well, they have um, utilities, they have a, a mortgage over their head, they have water, lights, they have employees. See, all of these things are things that they pay for every day. Did you know that those are tax deductions for those large corporations? Hmm. So if we have the same tax benefits as McDonald's, now let's look at the things that we pay for every single day. Our rent or mortgage, our Internet, vacations, cell phone bills, all of these things that we pay for every single day now become tax deductible. Yes, absolutely, tax deductible. So let me show you how this really works. This is our income shifting slide. 
see, we're teaching you to income shift by teaching you the power of business ownership because this is the only way you can use this information that I'm sharing with you. You have to have a business. So let's, let's show you how it works. Let's say you maintain your business every month for about $50. Well, that's $600 a year in savings because we get 100% of that as a tax deduction. Your children. We use a small number here, but we show you how to write off up to $6,300 using your child as an employee, and it does not affect your child tax care credit. Oh, yes, you don't pay taxes on that $6,300 because you don't go over that number, and, yes, it's a tax deduction. Wow. We show you how to do that, and it's very powerful. I'm sure you've seen a Gerber baby before, right? Yes. So home Internet, many, day, many times these days we all have Internet. Well, that's 100% write-off because, remember, earlier I shared with you that we do everything online. What else? Your cell phone. I'm sure you may be on your cell phone right now. Well, you're using your phone 85% of the time for business. At $100 a month, that's about $1,000 a year in savings. Hmm. Now, I want you to look at these deductions that I've showed you so far. Aren't you going to do these things anyway? Yes. So we just say, take your regular expenses and turn them into business expenses by using the MyEcon system. So let's keep going. Do you travel? Well, I do, and it's awesome because I write mine off, and I'm going to share with you how to do that. Dining, going out to eat, entertainment, driving your car. Yes, the government gives us $0.57 cents per mile to drive for business. Let's say you drove 10,000 business miles this year. Well, that's $5,700 in tax savings. See, this is major. This is a total of $16,000 in regular expenses that you pay for that you've just turned into business expenses. Wow. Now, let me be clear. We qualify for over 450 tax deductions, and I didn't even mention how you can qualify for writing off your rent and your utilities at your home. See, this is, this is the thing that's changing people's lives. They're keeping more money in their pocket instead of just making them regular expenses. So let me share with you one quick story so you can really put this into perspective. Let's say that I'm not in Texas, so I'll use Texas for example. I'm in Arkansas, and I decide to go to Texas on a prospecting trip. Now, on that prospecting trip, I drive my car, and I go to the hotel. I hand my business card to the clerk, and I tell her, I teach a strategy called income shifting. You should give me a call. That was business. So I attempted to do business just like the IRS tells me to do. Now look at the things on this list that tells me that I can actually write off. Well, my travel and lodging, my hotel room, driving my vehicle, me going out to eat, my cell phone bill. Isn't my phone number on that business card? Wow. Now that whole trip is tax deductible. But wait, can I help that my family stays in Texas? No, I can't help that. So I'm going to go and see my family anyway. And I'm probably going to tell them about the business too. See, this is major. We're changing our lives by just changing the way we do things and changing the way we see our money. So let's keep going. Let's look at what the IRS says because I'm going to share with you how this really applies to your income and what this looks like for your lifestyle. Now, the IRS says, where does your refund come from? It comes from your wallet or your purse. When you tell your employer how much to withhold from your paycheck or you make an estimated tax payment, for the average refund, that's about $40 a week too much. Wow. So we're just sharing with you how to do what the IRS says. So let's look at this right here. Let's say that you made, and this is actually a true story, let's say you made $48,000 at your job. That's a tax rate, single with no children, of 25% meaning you owe $12,000 in taxes. Now, I want to be clear. We know that we live in a, a progressive tax system. But we're using all simple, number, simple numbers just to be clear for everyone. Now, the government gives us something called a personal exemption and a standard deduction. Well, for a single person, that rounds up to be about $10,000. Well, we take that $10,000 off of your $48,000, and that makes you taxed on $38,000. The tax rate you're in is still 25%, and you owe $9,500 to the government. That's a lot of money to pay in taxes, right? Absolutely. So let's look at what happens when you apply that $16,000 we just talked about in your regular ex expenses that turned into business expenses. Well, 
you apply that to your taxable income, and now your your taxable income is twenty two thousand dollars, meaning you're taxed at fifteen percent, and you only owe three thousand three hundred dollars into the government. See, that's great, right? Yes, but even more is that you look like you made forty eight thousand dollars, but you were taxed on twenty two thousand dollars. That's major. In Arkansas, we pay state taxes, and this story right here, this person got back $1,800 from the state. Single, no children. And on top of that, he cash flowed $6,200 from federal back into his home. So let's really be clear. What's the worst thing that could happen to you in my econ? Well, you could save about six to $8,000 on your taxes. Yes. See, the thing is, we have to be able to shift our mindset so that we can begin shifting our income. And this is what we're teaching you. We always like to tell you we want you to pay the right amount in taxes and to do what the IRS tells us to do, and we do it legally. This is a gentleman by the name of Sandy Bakken. He's a CPA and former IRS tax attorney. And he worked for the IRS, and he told us, he says, well, every North American taxpayer who works a full-time job and does not have a side business could be overpaying taxes about three to $9,000 per year. Wow. What could you be doing with an extra three to $9,000 per year? Hmm. Something to think about, right? Well, Sandy Bakken said that I'm, I quit the IRS because I was tired of seeing them get over on people with their taxes. So now I write books and I, ha and I do sessions to show people how to do exactly what you all are doing. Get his book, Lower Your Taxes Big Time by Sandy Bakken. I'll say that again, Lower Your Taxes Big Time by Sandy Bakken. It's a great book and a great resource to share with you how we're doing what we're doing even more. It's just great proof. So what would your investment be for you to begin using these strategies, using this education, saving about six to $9,000 on your taxes? What would that investment be for you? Well, to start with my econ, it's $179 one time out of pocket. Let's be clear, to start a McDonald's, it's about $2 million out of pocket. So I think we're in a good business, right? Well, you're in the right place at the right time because right now our owners are doing a great special for us and sharing this information, it's only $12.95 to get started, and each month is $34.95. Guess what? All of that is tax deductible. Yes, it is, and it's awesome. We get a full financial success membership, and I'm going to share with you what comes with that right when we're getting ready to get finished up with this because this information is powerful. For $12.95, let's keep going. The first thing you get is the cash flow manager. This system allows us to be compliant with the IRS and keep our records properly. We take it, a picture on our phone, we enter our information, it links directly to our computer, and at the end of the year, we press print and our taxes are done. Yes, it's awesome. What else do we get? We have an ID, identity theft protection of up to a million dollars in coverage. That alone is powerful and really worth the monthly cost of keeping your business running because these days, identity theft is the number one crime in America. So it's no longer if my identity gets st stolen. The question is, when will it get stolen? So you want to be protected, and this is what we help you do, and it comes with our system. We have many products. We have many things that come with our success membership, even credit counseling, free and discounted legal care, tax preparation and advice. See, all of this comes with this membership that you're joining and gaining when you get into my econ on top of the education. See, this is powerful. We have products that we say, hey, if you're going to take vitamins, just buy them from yourself. Many products, many great things. What we believe in in my econ is just saying it this way. Become your own economy so that you're not affected by the economy. And let me show you one or two more things so we can finish up with this call. Another perk that you get just by coming into my econ is called the Cash Back Mall. We order things online from ourselves, and we're partnered with these companies like AT&T, Walmart, Sam's, Priceline. These large companies are partnered with my econ, and we say, well, if you're going to order and shop online, shop from yourself and get cash back. You can give it to your friends and family for free, and they get cash back, and so do you. That's powerful, right? Absolutely. But what else? 
we have travel, which is great. If you love to travel, we just say, hey, shop from yourself when you travel and get cash back. We love to have fun. We love to travel and do things like that. But we just say be smart when you're doing it and keep more money in your pocket. Last couple of things, and we're almost done here. How do you make money in my econ? Well, the first thing you can do for yourself is to use the strategies for yourself. Get this knowledge and education and understand it. And then we say, well, if you care enough, share with other people. Have you ever been to a great movie or a great restaurant? Yes. Did you tell someone about it? Yes. Well, did they send you a check? No. Absolutely not. So what we say in MyEcon is that if you have a great experience with what we're doing and you know people that would like to do the same thing you're doing, well, Tell them about it. Let them join up and share this information with them, and you'll the company will just send you a small token for doing so. Your first two people, well, that gets you to executive vice president, and that's the next level in the company. Now the fun begins because you're qualified for unlimited $1,000 bonuses for every seventh person that comes on your base shop team. See, this is powerful stuff. We train you on how to do this, but the most important thing you can do is help yourself. That's the key. I'm going to show you this last system, and then you're going to be able to get started with what we're doing. This is our cash flow strategist system. You see, I told you earlier we had the softwares and the systems. Well, this is one of the systems that helps us to get rid of our debt. This is how I know in six and a half years all of my, de my debt will be paid off because the systems of my econ work. You see, this system tells us pay this w this time, pay it this at this time, and then it tells you when you'll be completely debt-free. Wow, that's major. These people here, over $200,000 worth of debt, and were predicted to be there for 30 years. With the MyEcon system, they created cash flow, which is king, and then now they'll be out of debt in 68 months, which is a little over five years. That's major. This is the key, the real key. So. Let's actually do a, a short overview. This is our, what I call the formula for wealth is what we have here in my econ. See, we give you the system, we give you the software, and then we, create, we have the support for you to be able to use it properly. See, that's the key. But we're teaching the power of business ownership. And when I say the power of business ownership, it's time for us to begin taking control of our lives. We're teaching you how to lower your taxes, get out of your debt faster than create some business income to make that process go quicker and help as many people as you can, and then we're teaching you investment education. Now, I didn't go deep into the investment education, but it's important for us to understand that our money working for us is, is the major thing for us to, to help with our retirement lifestyle. On top of that, we're teaching you how to look at funds. We're educating you to have a, a good understanding of what the market is and for you to have an educated understanding an educated conversation with the financial advisor so that you can take control of your current lifestyle and your future. So let's actually get started with what we're doing here in my econ. It's $12.95, and we know that the worst thing that can happen to you is you save about six to $8,000 on your taxes. So let's be clear. There's two pains you can have in America, the pain of discipline or the pain of regret. So what's the pain of discipline? The pain of discipline is to use these strategies and education that you see in my econ so that you can build wealth for your future, or you can have the pain of regret to see something like this and not take advantage of it. So get that with the person that invited you to this call and get started now. Thank you.